Greetings, Geishings. Geishin Prime here with my live reaction of Seven, De yeah, Seven Deadly Sins, uh, Chapter 213. That's what we call love. And lovely was not a word to describe that intro. Ah, uh, alrighty. Some fan art and whatnot. Okay. I swear, if he is not related to Bond, that is going to be the weirdest part of this series. Okay, Sigma Headquarters. Ro is there, still fighting. Okay, there's uh, uh, Demon Clan people fighting off the humans. Please stop. No. Oh, wait, wait, wait. This this is what was happening when we didn't get to see anything because last week it ended with uh who was holding her uh, but uh Hildegard was uh being held by somebody who was it uh, anyway so and she's still alive well she's still alive in the present day so I'm just being stupid but uh she's not injured Please stop, no more. Don't hurt each other any further. Okay, there's an arc being shot at. Would an arc really do anything against, you know, anybody other than demons? Or does it ha affect people with malicious intent? Hmm, interesting. Anyway, uh, shut your mouth, you damn useless coward. If you've got time to sit around crying, then you fight too. Okay. Well. I don't know... Why he was calling Ro a coward, or was he talking to someone else? It's hard to tell. But, uh... Ro just kind of threw his sword at him. And now he did. Sir Ro, please stop this killing. What are you still doing here? If you don't want to die, then hurry up and get lost. Unless you... Wait, what is that? Some kind of plant that a fairy threw. And it impaled Ro's leg. You're nothing but a weak human. How could you do this? <laughs> weak, you say? Stay back. Don't come any closer. Yeah, you should have kept... Did, oh, Eldegar. Gerhardt. Why? Damn you, Beelzebub. You have failed me again. Ah. Uh, Gerhard. Yes, I, I've been saying the wrong name. Uh, anyway. At least I was saying a name, I guess. Ah. Anyway. Uh, if you don't stop, then I'll... Oh, so she's defending her fellow fairy, but well, it's probably going to end in what we saw at the end of last week's chapter. You'll what? Kill me? Yes, that works for me too. Go on then, do it. Is he calling her bluff? Or does he actually want to die? Lady Gerhard, hurry, hurry and kill him. Kill him quickly. I'm your enemy, an enemy of Sigma. Now kill me. Why? Why? Yes, why indeed. I'm. I'm. Good. Bah. The eye trauma. And the wing. And there's a dude's head that's just flying. That, that do the cutting. Oh, wait, that's the fairy that was behind her. I'm stupid. But we already knew this. <laughs> okay, so... Wait, who is that that did that? Another human? I mean, God, it, it looks like she's missing half of... Oh, wait, that's just her hat. Never mind. I thought that was her head. And Rose actually shocked at that. Quit, lo quit loathing around, wasting time, Ro. Just get right to it and kill them off. Huh? Uh, still trying to run away like an insect? Given their wings, they are insect-like. 
Ah, stop it. That's enough. Let's see. Already got your wings. I'll take your legs next. Oh, you are a violent son of a bitch. He just... Brother, this must be retribution. So he cut her legs off, or what? Nope. Because that dude got... Or... I believe she still has her legs. It's hard to tell. And I think that's the... Pretty sure that's the same guy that was... Yeah, that's him. I could tell by that almost bowl cut looking hair stuff. Uh, he's been stabbed. You goddamn fool. Why didn't you just kill me? Why does he want to die? Is he being controlled? When I talked to you about my brother. From somewhere within you, I felt a deep or a deeply suppressed rage and sadness and I also saw one lone face a little girl's face one that looked just like me okay that was my childhood friend we grew up in the same village one day when we grew up we'd fall in love it's a weird sentence one day when we grew up we'd fall in love any time she was picked on or bullied, I came flying to aid her, and we'd end up together. That's what I always thought. But she died before she could grow up. She was killed by Sigma. Wait, why? One day, Sigma launched a surprise raid on the village and killed everyone. Mm, excuse me. Without so much as a word. Leave alone a reason, explanation, or even excuse. When I tried to think of anything that could have spurred it, a few days earlier we ran into a lone member of the demon tribe that had collapsed on the road and nursed him back to health in the village. Okay, so what kind of demon is that? <laughs> it's not even a lesser demon that we've seen of so far. Even now, thinking back, I can still remember that demon was a good person. And her just missing that eye. I guess that explains why she has her eye covered up in the present. A lot of things are starting to come to light. <laughs> yeah. You weren't there in the village when it all happened then. Right? The four of us just happened to be in the mountains training our hunting skills. Okay, so there's the dude he just killed, and I think we've seen the other two before. And then the, obviously there's Rogue in the middle. And a random bird. Uh, we tried, we cried and cried, tried, and till our tears ran dry. And then took up swords and began to train for the sole purpose of taking revenge against Sigma. Stigma. I always want to say Sigma. And then at the la and then at last we took our revenge. And they all lived happily ever after. I wonder if she'd be happy too. What I've done. Ro, you It's no different than what they did to us. You are a terrible liar, aren't you? My ear is itchy. I wonder what Meliodas would think if he saw this. He's a good person, a good person who trusted in me. I'm sure your brother would kill me dead on the spot. Don't worry, I'll explain the situation to my brother. I too have committed an unforgivable sin. I just wanted this holy war to come to an end. I wanted it to end so badly that I looked to the other or that I looked the other way, kept my mouth shut, pretended not to see uh, 
Ludicell's cruel and wrongdoings. Oh, she's hacking up. Blood and whatnot. Don't speak any further. We've got to hurry and get you treated. Fuh. Fuh, fuh. Why are you laughing? For a while now, the face of your childhood friend had been floating in the forefront of my heart. I must said mind. Ah, your friend whose heart... Now I'm saying the wrong words again. Mm. Whose face looked exactly like mine. I feel like I'm seeing an illusion of where you'd been thinking. Caring about me all this time. Such a strange feeling. I feel this great warmth in the heart. What is this feeling, I wonder? Okay, now we're kind of getting to where the title is coming from. Oh, he sent something. Uh, uh, King is back. No, it can't be. Gerhard? Ro, take your hands off my sister. Why is he saying his sister? No, brother, it's not cough. Gah. Hurry, run. It's okay. I'm fine with it like this. No, Ro, you can't. I'm still thinking that's the ancestor to Bon. And that he does not die as such. But it, in the normal timeline, but given this trial, what if he actually does have to die and then Bond doesn't exist and then I don't know where the hell the story would go from there? Nah! <laughs> Survive, Gerhard. Live. Again, I couldn't protect her. We humans will take care of looking after the forest. But how could you? Is it that strange for a little sister to worry over her brother? You, you. Uh oh, something's boiling to the top. And he's about to be pissed. Yep, he summoned a sphere. I forget what it's called. A uh, Belquist? Something like that? I don't know. And he hurls it. Consumed by rage, he rains down a blinding burst. The time where they will be tested is coming. And what's it say here on the side? Without knowing any other reasons behind the tragic scene before him, he swings down a blade of hatred. The cycle of revenge can no longer be stopped. To be continued in chapter 214. I can't reach the you from that day any longer. Okay. Could be an interesting chapter. Can't really say I have much to add to this other than I still don't know what the trial is. <laughs> but, uh, we now know why Roe was rather sweet on Gerhardt because reminded of a childhood friend whom we now know why they're against stigma I don't it didn't quite make sense why they would attack that village other than they were humans or were there demons there I guess hmm no because that was later yeah I think that was later on. I don't know. I'm probably confusing something. But anyway. So yeah. I'm still wondering if he's an ancestor to Bond. And what if the trial is actually killing him. And then Bond doesn't exist. And then what does that mean for the story? <laughs> I don't get it. But anyway. Thank you for watching. Like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you next time. Keeshlings, roll out.